Three full days of heated competition marked the 2015 ACC Men's Golf Championship. Although the Old North State Club hosted the event for the 19th time, the course still served plenty of challenges and created a championship battle that would not soon be forgotten. Sitting tied for fourth after the first day of action, Georgia Tech shot nine under par on Saturday's second round to grab the lead heading into the Sunday final round. Clemson, Florida State, and Virginia were all tied for second when play began, each hoping to end the Yellow Jackets' dominance on this championship. Florida State posed a strong threat coming into the weekend as the number one team in the country. But the Seminoles found it difficult to capitalize on opportunities throughout the final round. The course's hills posed a problem for many golfers, but several found a way to master the sloping greens even in the damp, chilly conditions. Georgia Tech senior Ollie Schneiderjan's chipping prowess proved invaluable to his team. Fellow Yellow Jacket senior Anders Albertson made some spectacular shots. Run out, run out, run out, run out, golf shot. Here on the fourth hole, Albertson dropped this putt for a birdie. Clemson squad proved to be a force to be reckoned with as they took the lead several times throughout the day. Tigers senior Billy Kennerly made birdie on the 18th and final hole of regulation. This putt forced a tie with Georgia Tech, sending the two teams into a playoff. After one playoff hole, both teams went back to the 18th tee for another chance to claim the title. This time, four Tech players made birdie compared to just one for the Tigers, and Georgia Tech had its sixth ACC tournament title in the last seven years and its 16th in program history. Well, there's nothing better. You know, it was an incredible day with the way it started out with everybody in there to get, fighting and we got behind and, and really played the back well again today and that's really where we played there all three days and uh, obviously playoffs exciting, uh, but you know, nothing, nothing replaces winning. In the individual medalist competition, leaders came from unexpected places. Virginia Tech's Trevor Cohn began the day atop the leaderboard and maintained that position throughout most of the day. Robin Shiat Seacrest of Louisville made birdie after birdie to keep things interesting in the title chase. Georgia Tech's Andrews Albertson had seven birdies on the day and had a chance for the outright crown, but after double bogeying 17, his par on 18 forced a three-way tie at 11 under. Cone, Shiat Segrist, and Albertson were named tri-champions, ending an exciting day of golf at the Old North State Club. Last time I won, we, we unfortunately didn't come away with the team title, um, so that was disappointing. Um, this week is... Also, it's really special just to come away with both and, like I said, kind of go out this way. I mean, last time here, um, it's been really awesome.